because people can't tell when a joke is a joke. Sebastian Stan recently came under some fire because, um, because he joked about hating Tom Holland and not wanting to support him. With the release of Spider-Man No Way Home, Sebastian Stan was recently asked if he got to watch the film. And he said he had not gotten the chance to watch the film, but he loved seeing everything that the film was doing and bringing back all these characters from the past. And that that seems like a really cool way to handle Spider-Man's story and of course give the fans everything that they want. And this was all while sitting down and talking to Jake's takes. And then Sebastian Stan was asked, well, why haven't you seen it yet? And he said, and I quote, but I typically don't like to support Tom Holland, so it's difficult. I support the film, but not him so much, end quote. Man, could you imagine if Brie Larson said this? How every single channel would be running that same thumbnail of her and what the headlines would say. But of course, they actually, well, some people understood if they just followed the trail that this was said jokingly, and you can tell it's said jokingly. Like, you legit see his reaction. He says it jokingly and he laughs about it. And, it, you know, he's having fun. If you guys go all the way back to Civil War, when he started doing the press tours and Tom Holland is there with them, him and Anthony Mackie are both bouncing off of one another and they make fun of Tom Holland. Tom Holland makes fun of them about not having their own franchise and stuff. They're having this friendly banter between MCU characters that have clashing ideologies and histories and all this and he's having fun with it but i was on social media and i literally saw people on his social media pages like you know the tom holland stance and some hardcore mcu fanatics like literally going after him in his personal life because of what he said it's like guys he literally says it jokingly like it's a joke and it's just one of these things where it's fun right to have this type of fun remember in some of the interviews for civil war where Literally, like, Chris Evans would call out Robert Downey Jr. and vice versa, and they would make fun of each other. Like, that's what it's about, right? You're working with these people. You're in the same franchise as they are, and you're going to eventually team up. And, you know, Sebastian Stan even teased that in the future, seeing Spider-Man again and all that and working with him. So it's just one of these things that's having fun in Hollywood. And again, just imagine this entire scenario. I know many of you hate Brie Larson because of what she said and what's been twisted and then what some people are coincidentally saying that's the same that she was advocating but hey that's neither here nor there imagine if she said this how many headlines would you see and how much more would this be twisted you guys see what i'm saying just have fun with it okay go watch the thing the original source and understand what they're saying it's okay you don't have to hate sebastian stan because of a joke like he's not even one of my favorite actors i don't even really you know watch much that he does but hey he was having fun and some people don't understand sarcasm which makes me think how out of touch are you if you don't understand sarcasm when you literally see it and hear it no wonder some people are easily manipulated into just squawking whatever certain amount of people or certain section of fans want them to